with Grand Widow Fairlina. Ooh. Okay. So. Uh, so we beat an Ubercon, and that gate does not open. I, I, if you look at the map, it just it doesn't go anywhere. So, we actually have to go back around to the very first room uh, of trash we cleared, this big old circle. And the gate on the other side of the room is where we gotta go. Okay. So, more trash. Another room of trash. What do we got now? We have uh, got more skitters. I saw some reavers. Okay, let's hit the trash gad. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh! I should have said that about a noob. Yeah, there, <laughs> there is a possibility you can just shackle undead <laughs> the crypt guards. <laughs> Dude, the fight's too easy. We don't need to do that. Okay. Uh, uh, what the heck? Oh, here. Okay. Okay. Carrying spinners and one crypt weaver. Okay. The crypt weavers are the new guys. Crypt. 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 Okay, so the guy the guy calls them crypt weavers, but I think they're crypt reavers. <laughs> All right, excellent. Okay, um, hmm. Okay, crypt reavers, and they uh, they have a cleave and a poison. You kill them first, or pull them out and kill the spinners first. It depends on how much health they have and how much damage they do, but we'll probably kill them first. Um, and then the spinners that do the web pull, uh huh. They also have the frontal cone poison spray, so we gotta face them away. Uh, should we LOS get, pull these guys? What else do we have? Um, the second pack will have two necro stalkers. Uh, they're like the venom stalkers from before. Uh, well, here it says healers just be res ready to cleanse poison instead of fighting them out of uh, LOS. Maybe it, maybe they have less health or the poison does less damage or something. Let's take a look at the actual room. So we're going to have that the these skitter guys that are just around doing whatever. Um, then we have a bunch of the spinners. Like, this might all be one pack here. Let's see. Yeah, that's all one pack. Okay. Um, so these, these guys have their pull. That's super annoying. So, but we want them to all be like, oh. Yeah. I think we still LOS this. I think we still LOS this. Up the stairs. We go back here. Have a hunter shoot it from, like, right here and then just step around. Alright, here's the Reavers. Hello. What are you trying to hit me with? Poison spray? Or no, that was the spinner. Oh, we also have to face the spinners away. Okay, so. Um. We do the pull. We pull the carrying guys around here. And maybe we kill them first and then off tank the Reaver out here. That might make more sense, actually. Okay. Well, we'll just have to see how much damage they do. I'm not going to spend too much time on this. All right. And then it's another one of the, yeah, the Reavers and the Spinners. Okay. Um, This also talked about... Okay, more Skitters... Okay, so here's the next door that'll open, I think, when we beat Fairlina. And then Fairlina's up and to the left here. So Skitters. Where are those like new Venom guys? Are they maybe they're not in this version? More Skitters. Oh, here we go. Oh, they're up here. Oh, they're just Venoms. 
venom stock wasn't that wasn't that the original mob let's get my no blaze don't kill them i need them for science okay all right let's go back stalkers all right um now this is 25 man too so it's it's not huge if they're different oh yeah this calls them necro stalkers instead of venom stalkers um Poison charge. Uh, I guess it. We don't LOS them because they're by themselves, right? Like we don't need to hold them off somewhere while we kill something else. We just kill them. I I think that's why we just deal with the cleanse there. All right. So I think that's all the spider mobs. Let's let's finish these guys. And, um. Okay. So this room is kind of weird. So we actually go down into the left, and this is where Feralina is. Um, I don't really know what's up here. Oh, wait. Oh, that door I said before, I might have just been wrong. This is just how you get to, to the next boss. It's been a while since I've been in here. Okay, so let's go take a look at the next cash packs. Okay, so there's the shit talking as we get close. We have acolytes and cultists. Okay, so uh, the the cultists have a shadow burst. That's AOE knockback, does shadow damage, and is a threat wipe. All right. Oh, but it's not instant. We can interrupt it. Okay, easy peasy. Tank one against the wall. Ah, eh, just don't let any get through. Acolytes have a shadow bolt volley and an arcane explosion. These ads can be stacked up all together as long as your healers can handle the damage. You have to do about six pack of the packs of them before getting to Feralina. Uh, we have, I mean, again, this is, let's see. All right. Um, yeah, we got four packs in here and then all the ads up here. Okay. Do you have more ads in, in this version? Is it four or six? Oh, I don't know. All right. So, um, do we just LOS pull these guys? Let's see. I want a single target. I don't want to cleave it with my ice lance. I'll just get a single pull. There's a shadow volley. Yeah. There's an arcane explosion. So the cultists will get in first and the acolytes will get in later because uh, they have cast times on their stuff. Depending on how much health they have, um, this might just be really easy. All right, let's clear the room out. Okay. Grand Widow Feralina. All right. Um, for this one, I actually want to look at the Discord strap first. <laughs> it said, uh, I think Agbar wrote this one. Move out of Reign of Fire. Okay, so fire bad. All right. Tank says, one tank grabs Feralina. Make sure you're moving out of the Reign of Fire as it happens. Don't move the mob right before Enrage happens. So the mind control can silence it. Okay, there was a lot in that sentence. Make sure you move another if it happens. And then also, don't move the mob right before enrage happens. So the mind control can silence it. Okay. Other tanks pick up worshippers and tank them off to the side. So we have worshippers on the side here. And then, oh, there's two followers and four worshippers. Okay. Um, kill priority. The followers and then Feralina. Okay. What about the worshippers? Oh, uh, do we just off tank them? Oh, yeah, we'll see. We move, uh, move out of the reign of fire. Um, our mind controllers are going to be Miso and Burl with myself as a backup. Um, so we, we mind control a worshiper and sacrifice them to Feralina 
Doing that will silence her for 30 seconds and prevents her from enraging. Uh, oh, I see now. This should be done before the timer to prevent a tank or a tank one shot. So, uh, so that that other line, don't move the mob right before enrage happens, so the mind control can silence it. Uh, yeah, we just yeah we we want to we want to make sure that um the next uh the next silence is yeah is just done um before the enrage so we so we kill the warshippers first then and then use the followers to keep Feralina under control and then we uh and then we just burn Feralina, but we have to do it before um before time runs out because if she's enraged she'll just murder all of us um healers cleanse poison bolt volley debuff and move out of rain and fire so we'll be dealing with the poison volley too okay let's go more in depth now into the actual abilities okay so she does a poison bolt volley that's similar to the Sidis. uh she'll cast a poison volley which hits oh but it's not the whole raid it hits 10 random people every 10 seconds or so okay <clears throat> I need some water. Doing around 1450 direct poison damage and also applying a cleansable poison dot. Doing 450 damage every two seconds. Damage is resistible. Yeah, no one's going to wear NR for this. Um, So yeah, we just cleanse it. I mean, super easy. If it hits 10, 10 random people, then we don't need to do anything for groups. If it's like 10 closest or something, then we can use uh, poison cleanse totems or whatever. It should be easy. Rain of fire. We know about this. Uh, it's rough. Get out of it. This actually says warriors and rogues can put up to 150 to mitigate damage. I don't think so, man. I think we're just going to burst her down quick like. Okay, so her enrage has a 60 second cooldown deals more melee damage and increasing attack speed this needs to be countered with a sacrifice of a warshipper removing the enrage as well as silencing her poison volt volley for 30 seconds wait a second so the warship okay okay uh Captains pick up warshippers. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so we're not mind controlling the followers. We're mind controlling these four warshippers. So that actually gives us lots of time. Um, yeah, so we just have them off tanked, and then uh, we don't actually need Miso and Burl for this fight. We're, we're, I think we need just Miso to do it. Um, unless there's some debuff involved I don't know about yet. Uh, You must sacrifice the warshipper after she enrages if you want to stop her for the full 60 seconds. Sacrifice the warshipper after she enrages. Okay. If you sacrifice it before the enrage, she will merely delay it for 30 seconds. Oh, right. So she'll be silenced for 30 seconds. Um, but. Oh, but this says wait for the enrage to happen. If you wait for it to happen and then do the sacrifice, you get a whole minute. But if you if you never let an enrage get off, it only goes for 30 seconds. Is that true? Hmm. We're going to yeah, we'll have to keep that in mind. Okay. Um the worshippers and followers. Okay, I want about the followers. Super low health can be stunned. We can tank mez them or just kill them. Let's just kill them. Because then that that'll help like establish threat on everything else. If you you need to kill, yeah 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 yeah. I'm not worried about DPS checks. Yeah. They charge random people. AOE sign. Oh oh oh. So maybe like pull them off to the side, or something. Pull the warshippers off to the other side. Uh, we need to be spread out because of rain of fire as well. What's the strategy? Meaning of Burnlina off tank the four worshippers. 
killer off tank the followers then dps can focus on feralina um and then you mind control a war shipper at 50 seconds and then at one minute after at each time and sacrifice as he enrages to move it so um hmm. if our dps is good because she I mean, she only has a, a million and a half health right like we can kill that quick so even if we only get 30 seconds like it might be safer to just never let an enrage get off and just just hit her with hit her with one at like uh yeah at 50 right before the the first enrage and then just do it before the enrages happen instead of let instead of waiting for them to happen first even if that even if that cuts our total fight time down to a little over two minutes i don't think that's going to be an issue i think we can do a million and a half in two minutes um and if not then then we can try to time it but it is good to know about that okay i that's pretty much all there is to know about feralina i think what's gonna happen if she, when she enrages in this version I'm just gonna melee these guys. Hold on, while I wait for stuff to happen. There's the rain of fire. It looks different in retail. Oh, that's <laughs> that's a trinket from Shadowlands. Don't worry about that. Okay, all right, Feralina, are you enraged? I don't want to hurt you. <laughs> Leave me alone. Ah. Okay, so she casts the rain of fire and the poison bolt volley. I had it earlier. What about the enrage? Oh, it takes like a minute, right? All right, let's just wait. Let's just wait. There's the volley. But yeah, it's poison, so we can cleanse it no problem. I'm not worried about this fight at all. Uh, like points of possible points of failure that can cause wipes on this fight are if tons of people stand in a rain of fire or if like a mind control gets flubbed, but. I don't think that's going to be an issue either. There's the frenzy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. What we got, Feralina? Ooh. Look at all this great stuff. Okay. Okay. That's it for Feralina. All right. Taking a few minutes break, and then we're going to finish off the spider wing with oh jeez mix uh let's learn how to pronounce this first makesna makesna how do i get it to pronounce it what okay Makes no. Well, I, I guess it won't matter how the people pronounce it. Makes no. I want to say. Uh, makes no. Max no. I want to say makes no. Okay. All right. I'll be back in a few. And uh, I will go over the final boss of the spider wing. 